Wow, Latif just dominating Neo right now in this game. But Neo does have enough. He has enough meter to, to potentially come back in this match. Gets out of it with the EX pinwheel. Okay, here we go. Good read on the burn kick. Wow, Nusha jumped to beat that. Come down and take the round. Smart move. I told you Neo was a very, very smart player. He made that read. That was an excellent read. Untap will knock down off that sweep. Going for frame traps from Jury. Ultra catches him. That sexy pose. That's a, that's a good scene right there, just gotta say. No! No, catches him hitting a button. That is not how I like to see a uh, game end like that. And I understand what Neo was doing because he was crouch checking because if he EX Seismo, he would have been able to block. But Latif decided to just do the Ultra Bear and it paid off. Well, I mean, he was... <laughs> Latif was in a lot of trouble. It was... Uh... <laughs> yeah, and you know, he is... Jury, you know, Jury's definitely not respecting Latif. Like Latif said in the chat, he's not respecting him. He is putting on a lot of, lot of pressure. Latif, it was a good move by Latif. I mean, it was, you know, he, he barely had any life left. Probably could have lost that round easily. Might as well throw the Ultra out there just as a factor saying, hey, I will do it. You know, back off of me. And now that's going to help him later on in these matches because it's going to affect Widow uh, Neo and his, and his gameplay. So Neo's going to be afraid to... To pressure, and he's gonna have to be forced to think about his decisions a bit more. Anyways, guys, I need uh, we need we are not that far away from a thousand followers. If you if you guys are new to the channel, we only need 180 followers. I think we can make that tonight. It's the battle of the century! Fight! Unfortunately, that uh, fireball hit him. He could have got a much bigger punish out of that. Yeah, I believe that pinwheel is safe uh, on meaty. Trying to bait that EX, uh, I mean, so, I'm sorry, that heavy thunder knuckle. Latif with no meter. Let's see, uh, Ultra 1 go. Or Ultra 2. Oh, it is Ultra 1. I didn't realize he switched Ultras. Good stuff. Seems like it's actually paid off. Yeah, I love seeing Ultra 1 Jury because uh, you see a lot of amazingly cool combos in Rushdown Tactics. I have to say though, this is one of the more entertaining matchups I've, I've, I've actually seen in Street Fighter 4. It's definitely not boring at all. Nice dive kick. Trying to keep that corner pressure, backing up a little bit, gets thrown back into the corner. Ways to use the meter. You see that? Yeah, he tried to bait the ultra. He tried to bait something, and they were both in kind of a stalemate, just kind of waiting for someone to hit something. That was funny. That was pretty funny, but I mean, it was smart stuff from both players. Both players baiting something. 
see now um neil is playing a little bit smart he's respecting latif nor and he's forcing latif to have to respect neil's gameplay as well anyway so now it is 3-2 latif the <coughs> Neos just a little bit, just only one game behind Latif. And this is a first to 10 set, guys. We still have plenty of matches to go. So we have plenty of time for you guys to follow the channel. We have plenty of time for you guys to play in this uh, Twitter contest so you can win some TTT sir, TTC shirts from the Traveling Circus. You can follow, you can find out more information in the chat about that on how to enter. I feel like I'm watching a Marvel match, you know what I mean? As, as much as I hate saying that, but with so much action going on, this is really like, it's, it feels like a Marvel match, you know? There's just so much jumping, so much, so much random, I don't know, you know, but it's, it's all smart stuff. Sorry, I looked away and then I come back and I see just Neo completely bodying Latif. Neo keeping the pressure on Latif, using that meter to get out, uh, telling him to get back again. Maybe close to stun, I don't know. Bates the Ultra again and another taunt. Oh my god, Neo is just going in. Wow, it looks like Neo made that adjustment he needed to make. We have ourselves a match here, guys. Everybody, get on Twitter. Please tweet this match. This is insane. Uh oh, the tip saying. Uh oh, it looks like the tip getting a little mad. Look like he, he just stated it is done. Uh oh, it's getting, it's getting a little bit hype in here. Okay, Latif, we're gonna take your word for it. That means you can't lose the next match. You just said it was done. Weirdo Neo is showing that he's not afraid of the Viper matchup by any means. I would say that Latif is almost a little mind fucked right now. He's looking just like, if I could look at Latif's face right now, it would probably just be like his mouth completely down to the floor, jaw just. I am thoroughly enjoying this match. If you guys are enjoying this match, please follow the channel because there is plenty more of this coming in the near future. This is Ultimate Fight Night, guys. Battle in the Pentagon. Let's hit 1,000 followers, guys. Are you ready? Fight! Neil is just not giving Latif any kind of room to breathe at all. He is just constantly rushing down Latif, and I like it. He's, I mean, this, I think this is a great game plan because Latif has no time to think. Look at Neil just going in. He's not backing off. Just kind of playing in Latif's face, saying, "Hey, I'm not afraid of you. You don't scare me." So close, another ultra, he's gonna get hit. Uh, no, okay, yeah, uh, the EX pin will put Sajiri off of the ground. So uh, Latif's ultra actually hits on the ground, so she uh, evaded it right there. Gets up by Weirdo Neo, I'm sure he thought that through as well. I can't believe that uh, Latif is doing so many like wake up ultras right now. Like literally, he must be completely just 
not... Wow, I'm just like in shock right now. Did that hit. Did good stuff from Latif. Just does it again. That's gonna be a game with the Ultra One finish. Uh -oh, it's not looking too good right now. I can't believe we have ourselves a crazy match right now, guys. Latif in the chat, all he said was, wow. It's... Latif is going to have to do something different because it looks like Neo's not having that shit at all tonight. He's challenging him on the wake up ultras and everything. I'm I'm liking what I'm seeing. Guys, please follow me on twitter.com slash panda. Like me on Facebook.com slash panda x gaming and subscribe to me on youtube.com slash solid x panda. I will be uploading all these videos to YouTube, so please check back on that so you guys can rewatch these tons of great fights here going on guys. And special shout outs to the traveling circus. They are supplying us with those free t-shirts. I know you guys have heard it plenty of times tonight, but I'm so excited to be able to give these out to you guys for free. Just please follow my Twitter and uh, please tweet the message. Uh-oh, Latif said he's going to win. He said it only works for a few games. He's He believing. He Mike Rossman right now. It's the battle of the century. Fight! <laughs> Good block. All right, uh, let's keep doing well for himself this round. I think he might be a little mad. What will happen now? Fight! <laughs> That's a nice punish from uh, Latif. Latif has very good reactions, and he knows his uh, he knows his punishes. So Neo just going in for the chip right now. He's just not stopping. Yeah, there he goes. He just does not stop going forward no matter what. And I think that's really getting to Latif. It's really making Latif feel like I would feel like I was in a clusterfuck, honestly. Activates the Ultra, he's gonna try to uh, tr finish Latif off here. That was very risky from Latif, that is amazingly punishable on, on block. Alright, Latif ties it back up. With the EX size mode, this match is not, you cannot predict score this game at all because at this point it looks like they're dead even I can't even breathe right now <laughs> 